Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your weekend spread for this coming Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, November 12th, 13th, and 14th, 2021. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in your own private reading, all the information is down below in the description box below. Also guys, we are now accepting for $5 Friday. There is a cutoff time for 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here for Friday to accept them, uh, to accept your questions. Um, uh, I have some kind of function I have to go to. So, uh, but definitely, uh, if you are interested, just email me um, at debdoesreadings at gmail.com. It is $5 a question, obviously, uh, and I will get them all done on Friday. All right, so let's get started here. 10 card spread, 5 above, 5 below. I did clarify the last card as well as an outcome and a clarifier. There's two different messages here. Yes, I am feeling that third-party scenario. Here it is. All right, you start off first. I love these cards. I can never remember the name of them. That's the back of them if you want to look them up. But there's two aces here. So there's that divine energy here. Two aces is that 11. So divine energy. Now seeing that there is this closeness, that there's this meant to be relationship here. I'm feeling that, yeah, definitely twin flame with the empress here. Somebody is very, very confident. They worked on their energy. This could definitely be you here. They're manifesting for this relationship to take place here in regards to for them to come back, your counterpart here with the Page of Pentacles here. You you would be correct. You got the Page of Swords. It's divided here. You can see it. They are coming back. They I just heard retrieving. Oh, retrieving their love. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, but definitely communicating here, returning, okay, because they do feel that connection. They could have actually heard you with, especially with the twin energy, you can pick up on each other's energies absolutely telepathically here, but I definitely feel that you're going to hear them out. They could come back a little grumpy. Huh. I don't know why I'm feeling this, but if you take notice to his face, it's kind of like not in a bad way, but I feel that it's kind of like them admitting kind of like a happy days, like a Fonzie thing, kind of stubborn in, in admitting that you were right. Huh. Shame on you. <laughs> but here it is. Darn it, I you were right. I'm a little grumpy here, you know, but still taking that action here with the nine of wands here and making a decision, reflecting on, you know, the good times that you once had here and you and they want their happiness back with you. Okay. So there's definitely it was kind of cute. It wasn't mean or anything. Here it is. So I feel that they have a hard time accepting that you were right. <laughs> seven of swords i also feel that they overstressed about things i mean look at what he's holding on to you know that's heavy you know going off this cliff here so definitely stressing out but they now can stand firm in regards to showing that action with that king of wands could be dealing with fire sign energy uh leo aries sag here but regardless there is that stubborn energy goodness gracious dude uh that you were right okay I don't think that they are ever going to admit it, but I do feel that, you know, um, they're very proud <laughs> of themselves, you know, in regards to standing firm with what they believe, but they were wrong in their thought process here. And I feel that whoever is resonating with this, being the empress here, being able to manifest, to draw them back, good job. Okay, definitely, absolutely in order here. Congratulations. You have definitely made it clear to them because they can't drop you. You know, they have that strong connection with the six of cups here and they're coming back and communicating to you, okay? Just stay strong with this situation and hear them out, okay? Uh, but they do reflect in regards to the once upon time that you, they had fun with you, you know, and reminisce the good times here, making that decision to get you back with that two of swords and the three of cups here. In regards to a third party, got to do it. All right. I feel that somebody is kind of mad at themselves, okay? They know that they have to. This is your counterpart here. In regards to knowing that what they lost, I just heard, in regards to losing you. They have to make a decision where their true love lies here, you know, with three people here. And I feel that they have to stay strong here and realize the truth of the matter, all right? 
I do feel that they are making a decision in regards to a third party and returning to you, I feel. Yet again, that Empress, if you are dealing with a third party here, I do feel that they are very that you are very confident in making this decision. <coughs> Sorry. But I do feel with that Seven of Swords, there's that deceit, there's that third party here. But they have to stand strong. They have to make action. And I feel that action is with you. And that's what I have for whoever this is meant for. You guys rock. Have a good weekend. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.